What's up you guys, Marty Schwartz here, and welcome to another one of my gear videos. Uh, I've reminded you before, but every Thursday I'm going to have a new gear video, so I'd love to hear from you guys on the gear that you'd like to see me do. Guitar demos, um, you know, shootouts between two pedals, any, you know, any kind of stuff that you guys want. I'd love to hear from you and just leave it right in the comments and I'll check it out. Um, got a looper video coming uh, next week, so that'll be nice and fun. Uh, but yeah, just let me know. So anyway, in this video, we're going to be talking about the ever famous piece of gear for your guitar arsenal, the wah-wah pedal. Uh, I believe that the initial inspiration for this was the uh, old horn player, you know, long, long ago. Um, horn players would use a plunger on their trumpet or trombone and they would get a very crying kind of mouth vocal effect. And, um, you know, at some point a guitar player started to think up that idea on how to do that. And, uh, you know, eventually the wah-wah pedal was born. I'm using the, uh, you know, the standard issue uh, Cry Baby Wah Wah, it's been around forever. Uh, I've used Vox Wah pedals before, which I really like. And you know, there's obviously so many different kind. Um, I like the Cry Baby because I know what I get from it because I've used it for many, many years. And they're also one of the more affordable uh, Wah Wah pedals. So, you know, just keep that in mind too. So what's happening with the Wah pedal, as you can see, um, is you've got this little sweep motion of the up and down on your pedal, right? And so what that's doing is it's very similar to like a tone knob on the guitar. It's boosting frequencies um, or, you know, different different parts of the, of the tone. It's boosting it depending on your foot up and down. Anyway, I'm gonna, what I'm gonna do right now is I'm gonna uh, start playing around with this wah pedal. What I tend to do is I use wah pedal uh, with a clean tone uh, when I'm doing different funk type of rhythms. Um, now I will mix up lead guitar, you know, where I'm using an overdrive sound with the wah pedal just to, you know, get an expressive sound going. What I find is, you know, a solo with wah pedal, it, when I used to get, I'm not gigging much anymore, but when I used to do like a full night's gig and I was doing guitar solos or like in a blues band or anything like that, I would tend to use wah you know, on a solo, maybe like no more than like twice in the night. It really just depends on, you know, the situation. But I'm going to show you, I'm going to switch guitars too. So I'll, I'll use my um, Les Paul. I'm going to use my Strat. And we're going to hear some different sounds that I get. But some of the concepts I like is uh, one, just funk rhythm. So a clean, funky rhythm going where I'm doing like 16th notes and I'm using the wah pedal to um, just as you would tap the tempo of a song, you can do that with the wah pedal. So that's one way. Another way is when you're doing um, lead guitar and you want, you can think of the wah as a mouth opening. Wah, 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 wah. And so now you're articulating the tones of your uh, lead with your foot like it's you know a mouth opening and closing and then another effect i like is this slow um you know a slow bend where i'm holding that bend up and i'm doing da, 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 and i'm letting that wah go so you'll you'll be able to see the wah as i do that and then another idea that i like is in, in a more kind of um ambient texture where i'm using it as a filter with a chord where I'm using the wah really slow and it's very similar to what um, DJs are doing now with with filters um, in electronic dance music and stuff like that, which I'm not gonna be doing, but I'm gonna show you all those different ideas and you can see me in action doing it. And so I'm gonna do it on the Strat and I'm gonna do it on the Les Paul and you can check it out. All right, here we go. <laughs> Wow. 
fun with that uh lots of more gear videos coming remember every thursday there's going to be a new gear video can't wait to unleash all the different possibilities out there and i know you guys have been wanting that stuff and i want to give it to you here at marty music so thanks again and i just sort of busted my toe right out of my shoes so i need to go get some new shoes now so uh anyway thanks again and we'll see you in the next uh, video real soon